fans of the Hawkmoon have been excited since Bungie did their charity stream back in the summer and Luke Smith announced that the infamous Hawkmoon was coming back into Destiny 2. So there's evidence out there in the wild as to the exact week that this gun is going to be put into Beyond Light. So the following is a look at the Hawkmoon release date in Season of the Hunt. And don't forget, if you're new around here, hit that subscribe button down below for all the latest Destiny 2 content and turn on notifications by hitting that bell. So this one is going to contain potential spoilers, so if you don't want to know this info, feel free to skip on to the next video. We knew that Hawkmoon would be coming back in Beyond Light when it was revealed by Bungie on stream with this gorgeous artwork. However, it's not coming back as it was, which is probably a good thing. Originally a PS4 exclusive, it came with some devastating perks like Luck in the Chamber, where one random bullet in the magazine caused considerable bonus damage, and Holding Aces, where two more random bullets in your magazine dealed considerable bonus damage too. So Bungie did let us know that it's coming back in a slightly different form, so I have to see how those perks change when it comes back. Hawkmoon did have an interesting time across the three years of original Destiny, with its glory days probably being in year one, which was absolutely rubbish for Xbox players as they never really got to have it when it was in quote unquote full power. Hawkmoon was announced as part of Season of the Hunt when the trailer was revealed, and players were hoping that this might mean the Exotic Quest was going to be released on the day of the Season of the Hunt this past Tuesday, but fans were left disappointed, and it feels like the Lament and Cloud Strike are probably going to be most likely coming before Hawkmoon. There is some evidence out there as to when Hawkmoon will be released in the game, and JP Deathblade of Today in Destiny, a fantastic website which I will link down below, has been doing some digging around in the Eververse data and has seen January the 5th 2021 points to Hawkmoon's first ornament coming into the game. So normally when the first ornament is released through the Eververse store, that is when the exotic quest goes live in the game. And this was the case for other exotics like Traveller's Chosen. And it's worth pointing out that Bungie could change these dates at any time, but this is the biggest piece of evidence out there right now, pointing to a potential Hawkmoon release date. So Hawkmoon is the final piece of the puzzle when it comes to Destiny 1's holy trinity of hand cannons with Thorn and the Last Word. So I am super excited for it to be coming back into the game and can't wait for that date that Bungie puts it back. Well let me know down in the comments if you're hyped for Hawkmoon and if you've got any memories or stories from D1, share them down there in the comments. Well that is it for this look at Hawkmoon's release date in Destiny 2 Beyond Light and thank you so much for watching. For more Destiny 2 content like this, hit that subscribe button down below and subscribe to This Week in Video Games. If you want to join the community, check out the Discord link in the description or you can follow me on Twitter at TWIVG Podcast. If you enjoyed this video and found it useful, liking and sharing the video would really help me out. Otherwise, check out the other videos on the channel. Thanks again, I'll see you in the next video.